Hello students, after completing the types of SEO, today we will start with different techniques that can be used for SEO. Now in SEO, there are two different techniques. The first one is White Hat SEO. The technique White Hat SEO are approved by search engines as good design. Now when, it, uh, when we are talking about White Hat SEO, it is going to Focus on the human audience. Who are the people who are going to come and see the site? And how the humans are going to interact? White hat SEOs, they follow the rules and regulations which are specified by different search engines. Search engines, they give some policies, some rules. White hat SEOs, the techniques which are used, they are going to follow all these rules. It is also known as ethical SEO. Now, if I am using this technique, that means I am using keywords, link building, and any other type, this ways to optimize my website, then I am following white hat SEO. Now, different strategies which, which can be used are relevant content. So, if your topic is global warming, when you are writing the entire page related to global warming, you are providing relevant links, relevant information, well labeled images. The second important thing is you must have all the images are well labeled. When you are using white hat SEOs, at that time if the images are well labeled, it is going to help the search engine to rank higher. Next one, relevant links and references. If you are putting any kind of links in your website or of your friends of people you know, then see that the links are relevant and the references are also relevant. Okay, so just don't put any random links in the page. Just for putting more links, it is not advisable. Next, complete sentences with good spellings and grammar. So it is very important when you are writing the content of the website. The sentences must be complete. All spellings and grammar should be correct. So the content should be written very well so that people can come to your website again and again. Uh, standard complaint HTML. That means it should follow all the HTML rules. It should use all the HTML that is being uh, decided. Unique and relevant web, web sorry. Unique and relevant page title. Each and every page of the website must have a relevant title. Okay, so these are the simple strategies which can be used for white hat SEO. The next type is black hat SEO. Now these techniques, they are not approved by the search engine. The techniques that are used by black hat are manipulative techniques. So, there are some manipulating techniques which can be used for optimizing. These techniques, they come in black hat SEOs. The black hat SEO is going to target on the search engine. So, they are basically going to see how the search engine is going to increase the ranking. And they are going to use strategies related to that. Now, we all know that if we use keywords, then our website will rank higher. So what the person is going to do is, it is going to put the keywords throughout the web page. Global warming is this, global warming is this, global warming is using that keyword so many times is called stuffing of keyword, which is not at all advisable. So this is a wrong practice. Okay, the the black hat SEO techniques, they do not obey to the rules and regulations which are given by the search engines. Okay, and another very important thing, if the search engine comes to know that a website is using black hat SEOs, then they can ban those websites. So the websites which are using black hat are for a limited period of time. The span of that website is very, very less. Once the website is banned, if you will, even though if you are using the URL, then also the search engine will not return that website. 
So black hat is not at all advisable. The strategies used over here are duplicate content. That means the same uh, things, the same text is going to be repeated again and again. Invisible text and stuff keywords. Stuffing of keywords. Everywhere it will use keywords. Global warming, global warming, global warming. So it is full of that keyword. Clogging or redirecting user to another website. Now it may happen that they will portray at one site that this is the website, the website is all about this. And when you open the website, you will be directed to another page, entirely another page which has no relevance. Okay. So this is one of the very uh, black hat techniques which is used. Links from sites with non-relevant, non-relevant which are not at all related to the content, will it will have links for that also. So this strategy is basically not at all approved and should not be used. Okay, so now let's see a few differences between the two. The differences, the first one, it is ethical SEO, it is unethical SEO. It targets humans, it targets search engines. Now here, it is concentrating on the content. Content is for the humans. Humans will read the content, they like the content and they will come back to the site again. Now this is for the search engines. They are keeping how the search engine is going to increase the ranking. What are the algorithms which are used by the search engine? However, it is not possible to identify the algorithm, but they are using some manipulative techniques for this. Its goal is to rise in organic search. Now, when we are using white hat SEOs, we are targeting that in the search engine, in the organic search, the website ranking should be high. And that ranking should continue for a longer time. So this is the goal of using white hat SEO. Its goal is manipulative search results. So they are going to manipulate the search results and they are going to be getting the ranking for the website. But this is for a short span. It is going to be there only for a small span so that they can make good business and then the site can be banned. They don't care. The last point says it uses Keyword, link building and writing quality content. So these are the tactics or strategies which are used in white hat. They are using keyword, link building, all that is advisable. Okay. And here uh, in black hat, they are using keyword stuffing, invisible text and page swapping. Now page swapping means they will say this is my page after they get the ranking. Let's say they are saying the page is about global warming. After getting the ranking, they change the entire page. And when a person clicks on that website, the page is not related to global warming, but something else. So this is what it means by page ranking. These are the few differences between white hat and black hat. Okay, so you must remember these. Alright, thank you.